Good morning from Singapore. We are here in Singapore for the next few weeks. I'll be staying here and working here for a while and vlogging my whole time here. I'll show you around all of my favorite spots, places to eat and shop. So hopefully it will be a very fun week. I'm just finishing getting ready for my first day at work. Landed last night and I have to admit, even though it's a three hour time difference, oh my goodness, it was a struggle. So what happens when you're not a spring chicken anymore. Singapore is kind of like my second or third home away from home. I should probably explain that my company that I work for is actually based out of here, which is why I travel here so frequently. Hopefully you'll get a feel for what it's like living and working in Singapore. I discovered another new lipstick, which I absolutely love. It's the Revlon Shine So Sleek Pink. It's like a corally pinky color. It's so pretty. This is my current makeup situation. So everything is laid out. Do you guys unpack all of your toiletries or do you mainly leave it inside the, the case? I tend to leave most of my stuff inside. Hopefully my makeup will somewhat last in this heat. It is so humid. If you've never been to Singapore, I would say it is a tropical concrete jungle. As soon as I walked out of the airport, it just felt like a blanket of sweat. But I'm not complaining because I actually live for warm weather, but it's just gonna be very hard to look somewhat cute while in Singapore. So if you see me struggling, you'll know why. It's because it's bloody hot. Let's go to the office. are having dinner at level 33. Check out this view. Oh, oh my gosh, it's so pretty.
morning another day in singapore i'm back in the office all day today but we have something super exciting on tonight it's our end of year party where the whole company gets together get dressed up and the theme this year is retro so it will be a chance for us to let our hair down i'm going to finish getting ready and then head off to the office and we'll see what the day brings We're here at our Christmas party. We better win the best prize. Oh, and the door prize. It is the end of a very, very long week. Thank goodness we're going to head to dinner to my friend's place, one of my work colleagues who has so kindly organized get together outside the office. It's always nice visiting a city and having friends and seeing how locals live to get an idea if one day we were ever to move here, what it could be like. weekend from Singapore. I am so glad it is finally the weekend so I can explore a bit more of the city beyond just the office and the room. I have the whole morning to myself so I'm going to try and squeeze in a little bit of filming. It's been quite challenging trying to grow the channel while traveling but it's something that I definitely enjoy because it is completely different from my day-to-day -day work and a bit of my creative outlet so I don't mind but it has been quite hard to find time at the end of the day. And before I start filming I popped out to get a coffee this morning from Yakun Kaya Toast which is a very famous Singapore brand. My order is the coffee O with condensed milk or is it coffee C? Coffee C with condensed milk and it is delicious. I definitely needed this this morning. I just finished an hour of filming so I'm quite proud and so now the room is super messy it's always like this just after filming but nonetheless by the time you see this you would have seen me unbox my Lady Dior Mini in the latte color I cannot wait to take her out to dinner tonight which is why I had to unbox her today so now as a treat I'm going to head to the pool and just go read a book for a couple of hours and the weather looks like it's cooperating today. It is beautiful and sunny and I'm sure it is very hot outside. I'll just ignore this and clean it later. <laughs> Thank you. 
walk up for dinner down Clifford Pier. If you come down here, you'll get such nice views of Marino Bay Sands. Are we heading out tonight, babe? That's a good question. Where are we heading? <laughs> we <laughs> are. Sat. <laughs> we are heading out to finally get our first Hawker Centre meal. Cannot wait. Cannot wait. It's a very Singaporean thing to do. So if you do come to Singapore, you'll definitely have to visit a Hawker Centre. Yum. <laughs> <laughs> one of the top 50 bars in the world for a cheeky cocktail after work.
I am finally back after a long day of work. I feel like I haven't had a chance to check in with the vlog in so, so long. Partially because I've just been in the office at work and I just wonder if it gets a bit boring after a while seeing some of that. Um, but nonetheless, it is now midweek here in Singapore. Adam's just heading back to Australia now as we speak. I'm a little bit envious because I'm feeling kind of homesick and would love to be on the same flight. But I'm trying to be grateful to have the opportunity to spend some time working overseas. At the same time, I also do miss my own bed and I do miss my dog. So it's, it's, it's a mix of feelings at the moment, but I know I'm heading home very soon. One thing I am experiencing here in Singapore is a little bit of cabin fever. I realize how tiny the city is. I go a kilometer this way or a kilometer that way and I feel like I've covered the whole city. Having said that, it's the size of the city makes it perfect if you're ever transiting through Asia and you need a bit of a stopover. Singapore is a great city to visit and see the whole city in probably about two or three days to get a full experience of Singapore. So in that sense, the size is an advantage. I've just come back to the room to get changed and grab some drinks with a friend here. That's another beauty about Singapore. There is always a new restaurant or a new bar to check out. There's just something opening all the time. So if you like that sort of fast paced city where you can check out new bars and restaurants, this is a foodie's dream. Outfit of the day check. My bag is from Chanel. Dress is from Ted Baker. I've had this for a while. It is definitely worth investing in good quality work clothes from time to time because they last forever. And shoes are from Nine West, these ballet flats. I have been living in them the whole time I've been here in Singapore, but I am a flat girl through and through. I refuse to wear heels. All right, let's grab a drink. I'm gonna head to the airport a few hours early, spend some time at Jewel Terminal. It is one of the best airports in all the world. So tired. My nails are falling off. That's how you know it's time to go home. I need a manicure so desperately. I 